<laughs> okay, all right. all right. Today we are making Ted Cod. Ooh. I've never had this before. Oh, he's gonna be obsessed with this. All right. Gonna, I, I can't believe I haven't introduced this to you. And so- Oh, look at that pork belly's my favorite as well. James's first introduction to Ted Cod is one that we make, so we'll see. It better be. It has to be good then, or else it could spoil my, uh, you know, future with this dish. Tikka is braised pork and eggs in a delicious sauce that you eat. I hope so. That you eat over rice. This is gonna be our first rice dish that okay, we're making. So okay. Far. Okay. Okay. I mean, and I'm, that do we're making. I'm doing this hungry too. All right, let's do it. Tikka, boom. Okay, let's, let's start with the, with the pork belly because this is what I'm excited about. How do we, how do we, uh, oh, do you have to take the, 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 this off it? So after further research, <laughs> I think that we are going to remove this skin because it's not like being fried, is it? Do you know what I'm saying? And there is a gelatinous um, texture. texture that is in a lot of Vietnamese cuisine. All right. It's a good knife we got there. Yeah, you gotta have you gotta have a shot. You gotta have uh, good tools, aren't you? Cuba rock. Cuba Gooding Jr. James does the cutting. Cu cutting. You said because Gooding. I was like cutting. James does the cutting. <laughs> the Cuba Gooding. <laughs> James does the cutting. Cuba Gooding in this, Jr. In this household, I leave the cutting to James. You have to do it with a firm hand. And his sturdy hands. Right. So it looks like about that size pieces. Those look too big for you though, babe, don't they? So we need to, we need a pound, pound, right? One pound. I'm gonna half these up. Yeah? Yeah. Just All right, half. just half them up. I thought they were a bit big then, them chunks. That's, that's, that's no, better, yeah. isn't it? That's a better size, isn't it? Like that size, yeah. Okay, cool. So we have to half the half. That is pork, pork belly. Pork belly. Okay, it's so pork shoulder. How much pork shoulder? Pound. Pa a pound of this and then like sort same, of in the same, cu cube it up. Okay. So close, oh that's so close. Cube her up, yeah? Cube her cutting junior. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> James's dad jokes. That's my uh, that's my English English humour. Is it English really? I think it I think it sort of is that, yeah. I think that's it's just James's dad from. jokes. Yeah, it's a definitely a dad joke, right? <laughs> okay. Beautiful. That again uh, is a lot of pork. So we need lots pork. of pork. This dish with white rice is so good. Gotta love a bit of white rice. Do you know you? why? Because it's man, it's salty, it's very flavorful, and so with white rice, it's just like. Bit of a rinse, or are you just filling her up? Got our rice to cook. Let's go. Very exciting. <laughs> white rice. Start. Sixty minutes. Sixty minutes. All right. Boom. Feed a bit rice. So we got four, four quarters. Is one gallon. So it's like two to three. So that would do. Oh, there's James. There's James. Oh, in you there. can see my reflection. Hiya. Right, okay. Calls eggs. for eight eggs, but V doesn't eat eggs, so we're gonna go uh, six eggs. Six eggs. Six eggs, okay, half a dozen. You tell me when it looks like an inch, guys. It's heavy. Ah, well, you see, I should have done the eggs, you okay. see. <laughs> So this will so, and then you bring to a boil and then when, when it starts boiling is that when you start the timer? Just one out of the drawer, it jumped out at me that Watch actually. out! Don't get burned. Nah, I got it. It's alright. Right, here we go. One, how many? Two minutes? Yeah, one to two minutes. Okay, we'll leave it in there it for one minute. It to to a boil, you think? We'll, we'll take it out at 11.30. Alright, so that's, that's your pork. And you got to rinse it, yeah? So fresh, so clean. Ready to go. Coconut soda. Just like one full coconut soda. Um, so it is no, it's hard to find coconut soda, you know. <laughs> you gotta go you gotta go Asian market to get it. So half of one of these. I like the method. So 
this is basically just sugar, <laughs> coconut sugar. You make them even. You know it's half. A tiny bit more here. Okay, coconut sugar. All right, bang on even. Three, right? Did you say? Yeah, three. Okay, here we go. Fish sauce. Never lets us down. This stuff. <laughs> okay, one. Hi. But Yoi. Yoi. Coconut soda, exactly six six fluid ounces you'll find right there. Perfect. Okay. Okay, and then with two teaspoons of salt. Two teaspoons of salt. More. All fizz. Hi. Okay, good job. And you know what? I, I feel like we had to add the pork first. <laughs> That's okay. You are the navigator. I know, but it does not say at all to put the to put the pork first, see? Oh, you see this it is, just says drain, drain, then rinse the pork it's under running water guys. until the water is clear. And then it says add the, yeah, okay, now we want to add filtered water. Yeah, okay, filtered water. How much? Just to cover? Yeah, just until it covers the pork. You know what, this already smells bloody, bloody good, you know. <laughs> now we turn the heat high. Yep. Yeah. When boiling, lower heat to about 25% heat. Okay. And then we simmer, simmer for about 1.5 to 2 hours total. Okay. Leaving covered for the first 40 minutes. Would you say that's a high boil? I wouldn't. I'd say that's... Let's give it a couple minutes and see if it goes any higher. It, like proper boiling, you know what I mean? Like a, like a um, cauldron. Like a witch. <laughs> The eggs are about to boil. What happens to the eggs? You put them in cold water. No, so you just turn off the heat and then set it aside for eight minutes. Oh, it's still in the water? Yeah. Ah, okay. This is a cool technique. Let's call it then. Yeah, let's call it. Okay. Alright, okay. So this goes down to 25%, right? To a simmer. And this comes off, yeah? This just Look at the timing on that. Look at the timing on that. Both Yay. at the same time. Good job, guys. We made that. We made we made that happen. We did, that. We, we, we did it on purpose. Yeah, it was, it was absolutely if intentional. If anybody asks. Absolutely intentional. Eggs. We're going to let them sit. And this is still simmering. You got to stir, yeah. So it says we have to stir every 20 minutes. So I'm just going to stir it up. Shout out to Hungry Hui, Hungry Hui's recipes who we're using. And we'll put this back on for another 20 minutes. All right, uncover this food. Karen, do what you're doing. I've got to run out and help my brother do some moving. Okay, bye. So a month to move. Okay. But I'll be back before we need to do anything else. All right? Love you, babe. Bye. Taking the lid off now and gonna leave it off. Let it simmer for another hour and 20 minutes. So I'm making Nook Mao, which is sugar syrup. And literally all it is, is sugar and water. I'm gonna add the sugar in there. And then I have to watch over it closely, it says, for eight to 10 minutes. So I will be standing here stirring for eight to 10 minutes. So you can see the sugar is turning into a liquid. So once it gets to a dark brown, this is when we're gonna remove it from the heat and then add the water. This is supposed to get pretty dark brown. It's getting there, isn't it? And it says just when it's about to smoke or when it's smoking and gets yeah. dark, then you remove it from the heat. Slowly. Back on the heat, yeah? Yeah, just turn it off. Guys, we cannot do this. We have very, very, very... This is hard to make. Oh, 
Bloody hell, what is it supposed to be? That's what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be a caramel syrup. Crystallized on us, turned back to sugar, set the fire alarm off. This is attempt number three. This is attempt number three. Kay. Okay, that's going in, dude. Yeah, in there. You're in, you're in, you're done. Okay, onions going in. Ooh, eggs. Eggs are in there. So we're doing things to taste now. So you said another what? Another two. Two. Yeah. Or just one and a half, maybe. We got it, guys. I think we nailed it. I right. Well, that, that well, I'm happy with it then. If we don't need to add anything to it, and the reduction's down to a third of the water. I'm excited about the sauce too. Maybe we can keep the sauce, the extra sauce, in a little uh, bottle. Yeah. There we go. All right. I'm Woo. so excited. All right, good job. Good I, job, team. Uh, that was a little sketchy in the middle there. Um, Once again, this is going to be a quick review because I think we're just going to snuffle this down like, <laughs> so quickly. It's <laughs> like cook, cooking and like uh, hungry is, is very difficult. We're hangry. No, not quite, but we're getting there. James never admits to hanger. Yeah, I'm just I'm just hungry. We started at 7:30 this morning, and um, it's 2:15. So you know, we take we take a bit. There were a few mishaps along the way, but yeah, that's a, why. Yeah, I had a bit of bacon. I should have had a coffee or something. It shouldn't take that long. We just take long. Yeah, we okay. don't know what we're doing. <laughs> okay. All right. So. All right. Serve serve it all. Yeah, I'm gonna serve the first, and then you can pick from it. Okay. I'm gonna be picking all that. Okay, and then we can break the egg. I tried a little bit of this earlier, as you saw. And I was very excited about it, so I think James will really like it too. Okay, here you go. I remember no egg, baby. Yeah. Just some meat. There's That's a good. Egg, a little bit of egg fell in oh, there. Oh no! I'll have him. Okay. And then I'm just gonna get an onion. Yeah, get an onion. A bit Perfect. Of <laughs> All right. All right. I'm so excited. I, we haven't tried the meat yet, but here we go. Oh. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers with what? Cheers with good the job, cheers love. with the meat. Yeah. Good job. Good job, baby. Meat. Cheers. Woo. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh god. Right? Oh, I really like this. Mmm. I can't believe we've made mm. this. It tastes like tikka. Mmm. I love the onion. Oh, it's real good, man. Real good, right? I was worried it's gonna be too sweet. Mmm. <laughs> I feel like we need to once we turn off the camera, we're gonna go ham with spoons. Yeah. <laughs> what do we need to use? Chopstick for effect for now. Mmm. 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 Mm. Mm. I can't. I can't tell you. Is it because I'm just so hungry or it might be that. actually amazing it's really good mm. it's like fatty syrupy sweet yeah and you know what? <laughs> what what's funny is and i was telling james earlier this is the most simple recipe that we have dealt with yet it took us the longest and it was not the longest it was the it was the mm. biggest ordeal mm. for us yeah this would be the most tricky you almost burnt the place down <laughs> So tikka was always one of my favorites growing up and I feel like mm. the veil has kind of been lifted with its mystery because I was always so nervous to try cooking it because I was like, it's probably super complicated, but it's, so it's pretty simple. Mm. It's amazing. Right? Yeah. We made that. I feel like everything that we do, we know what went wrong. Yeah. So the second attempt on all this stuff is just, we're going to be, we're going to be really happy with it. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I'm happy with this, but you know how sometimes you do things for the first time and then you, you're not, it's not as much pressure and then it ends yeah. up being really good. What if we do it the second time and we try to be too perfect? Yeah, we're like, we got this <laughs> and then we, and we don't got it. Um, yeah. But I always used to think that this was very difficult to make and... It seems like it might be because it's you know, something so nice, it tastes so good mm -hmm. and you're like, oh man, I can, I, 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 you know, how can I make that? How do they do that? Mm -hmm. You know? One thing I would put in this maybe would be uh, uh, make it a little bit more kai. Ah, ah, spices. A little bit of a uh, chilies yeah, in there. Yeah, yeah. Do, you, do you want your spice, oh, spice man. bowl? No, you know what? I'm happy. I'm happy mm. with it. No, but doesn't, everything doesn't need to be spicy. Yeah, this is this is actually that is a good point you bring yeah. up. It's one of the things where I don't feel like I'm missing kai. Weird, because I just thought uh, maybe <laughs> not like sriracha, but like a couple yeah, yeah, yeah. little red chilies in there. Right. You know, it was really a pain in the ass. The, the caramel syrup. Yeah. That's Technique. What, that's what slowed us down. So that's, I would say, mm. is maybe, if you're doing it for the first time, it's probably the hardest part of it. Mm. 
that's what slowed us down. But once you get the caramel syrup down. This technique, you've got to get it so it's the sugar's all caramelized and melted together. And you always got to match the temperature with the water. So if you put boiling water in there and keep make make sure you keep stirring. Always if, stir, if constant you, stirring. Yeah, if we throw normal temperature water, room temperature water or whatever on it, it just crystallizes the sugar back up, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Turns it back into sugar. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, I'm very happy with this. Yeah, I'm if I got this in a restaurant, I'd be, I'd be, I'd be like, wow, that's amazing. We're going there again. All right, well, should we scarf down? Say bye to the people. I feel like I've been scarfing down. <laughs> but yeah, I think if you if you follow that recipe, hungry we. It done good. Thanks, hungry man. Wheat. Yeah. Yeah, it yeah, was yeah, one yeah. of the most simple recipes I found as mm -hmm. well. So and I can't stop eating it. All right, nitrogen sal. Nitrogen sal. Good job, Nate. Next time we're doing. Should jam on maybe. Woo! See ya. <laughs> no, I want to eat it with a spoon. <laughs> uh.